Hello! It's me, your boy, uh, Dylan slash Orem. Welcome to the channel. It's been a minute since I've posted anything here. Uh, there's a reason for that. Mostly, I've just been really busy with work. For those that don't know, I work for the YouTube channel Comic Storian and all of the, the goings-on that it has. And recently, there's been some new goings-on. Specifically, we have launched two new channels, of which I am a primary host of. We've got the one that's probably more interesting to you, Absolutely Marvel and DC, where we talk about the, you know, like the CW shows, Falcon and Winter Soldier, all, all kinds of stuff. Hello to, I can't believe I noticed that Orm is wearing a man bun today. It's just a bun. But it's on a man, so that makes it a man bun. Is it? Who's it to say? <laughs> I have a qualm with you bringing that up because okay. you've made this episode worse in my eyes now. <laughs> you compared the fantastic writing device of um, killing half of the population and then skipping forward five years and having the fallout of that felt over multiple television shows and movies to, I don't know, I was in a mirror world for three months. <laughs> the only reason that he deleted his brain in Most Wanted was because he had a backup. <laughs> this, Tony Stark is constantly backing up his brain. I'm sure in the interim between like uh, Avengers and Age of Ultron before he worked on uh, Ultron and eventually Vision. I'm sure he was playing with backing his own brain up. Yep. Why would he not? Is this is this feasible? Because like if we get this robot working, I'm gonna have my right. own robot body. That I'm for. And we've got some exciting news today. We've got official release dates for Black Widow, Shang Chi, Eternals, and Spider-Man: No Way Home. We also see Sam and Bucky travel to Madripoor, a staple of Marvel Comics. Well known to be Marvel's CD underbelly, it's a favorite place of characters like Wolverine. Maybe he'll show up. He won't. But what a fun thing to think about. Welcome back to Superheroes. It's 60 seconds. First appearing in Young Avengers number one, Kate Bishop was a mysterious young woman armed with a bow. We're all over there, talking about comic books and comic book related properties. It's a good time. So if you want more of me, you could go over there. The other one, the other channel, is called PlayStation and Steam Gamers, or more colloquially, colloquially referred to as PSG. Who's that? Me? I'll go next. Yeah. Oh, we're all looking at you. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I mean, basically the order of the cameras, it seems <laughs> yeah. like you would be next. Oh, okay. Hey, I'm Dylan. <laughs> and of course, the most important and revealing, who is in this ship that Reinhardt and May are jumping into? It's the totally new characters Brigitte, Mercy, Winston, and Sojourn. Or Genji, that might be Genji, but it's probably Sojourn. It's hard to tell. Very important stuff. I've already downloaded the PS5 upgrade to see how that plays. We can talk about that a little bit. You need to at least download it and do that portion. Houston is on this channel. He's another host. Why no, but can't you're the Avengers it? guy. It's you and me, Dylan. No, you and me. Not <laughs> Ride or die. Ride or die with Avengers, Dylan. I'm That's the you PC and me. Avengers guy. <laughs> Today, we're going to be talking about BlizzCon Line 2021, their opening ceremony. Everybody else will also be getting matching outfits in the aerospace theme over the course of the next few weeks. The release windows of both Horizon Forbidden West and Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart were both confirmed to still be 2021, specifically the back half of 2021. Don't worry, this isn't like, this isn't changing the, the release schedule. Uh, that doesn't exist of this channel. It still doesn't exist. Um, if you were hoping that this would somehow increase production of videos, you're sorely mistaken. I, I am still working on stuff. I'm always working on stuff for this channel. It's just because I work five days a week, sometimes more, depending on if schedules go awry. I only really have Saturday and Sunday to work on videos for this channel, and by the time Saturday and Sunday roll around, I'm pretty burnt out of editing and video production, so it's hard for me to work on that. I've mentioned this before, I'm still in the process of building a set and getting wardrobe for a video that I hope I'll be able to bring to you soon. I'm almost done with the set, I just need to find some time to finish like one more prop and then I will be able to film that. This channel is mostly just my post whatever and then post my big ideas when I have time to get to them. So yeah, it's a Star Wars video. I don't know if I mentioned that. Go to Absolutely Marvel in DC and go to PlayStation and Steam Gamers, also known as PSG. That's where I've been. You can find more of me there. Stay tuned for more content.